everyone. My name is Karina, and I'm the Director of Education here at the Fairbanks Museum. Before we dive into the fun stuff, I do want to let you know that we do require masks here at the museum. We do offer them here in case you forget. Um, we have them for sale at the store. But for the purposes of this video, me and my friend Sarah are not going to be wearing masks, but I can assure you that we are being safe, and as soon as we're done with this video, we will be putting our masks back on. Now, I would like to reintroduce you to a fun project that we brought to you a few months ago. It's called the Eco Critter Challenge. Now, this time, we teamed up with Aquarome Aquarium, which is our local pet store here in St. Johnsbury, to bring you some really cool live animals that I'm going to introduce to you throughout this video series. We came inside the museum now into our education classroom, where we teach school groups about cool things at the museum. And I brought you some cool creatures to check out. These are crickets, and crickets are a type of insect. Come on over so that you can see them closer. Now, insects are creatures that have antenna. They have six legs, and they have compound eyes, which means they have lenses all over their eyes that they can see in different directions. Now, these guys, um, they some of them have wings where they use um, to they rub them together and it makes this beautiful chirping sound to call to each other. Um, another cool thing is their ears are actually on a set of their legs. They're on their knees, and that's how they hear. They don't look like ears like ours, but they have these little um, membranes on their ears, where, or on their knees, rather, where they hear out of, which is kind of cool. Another cool thing about crickets is that they, some scientists believe that you can tell the temperature of the out, outdoors based on how fast the crickets are chirping. The crickets need warm weather to use their muscles and to warm up their muscles. And so the faster they're chirping, the warmer it is outside. All right, we'll see you out there. Hi everyone, my name is Sarah and I'm one of the AmeriCorps members here at the museum. And I wanted to show you one of the eco art critters that I made at home using materials that I had at my house. So this is my cricket, and it is made out of toilet paper tube, and the legs are all toilet paper tubes cut up, and I made the head out of an egg carton. Um, it has super long legs because crickets have long, powerful legs that help them jump. And I added some um, post-it note wings and long antenna. You can also make an eco art critter using natural materials. Here I used some sticks, a pine cone, and a rock to make all the legs, the body, the head, and the really long antenna. Come visit us at the museum to make your own eco art critter.